All right, here's what's going on, and it's wild. The CEO of one of the top AI companies says half of all entry-level jobs could disappear in the next few years. Google just dropped a video tool that's so realistic, people can't even tell what's fake anymore. Opera turned its browser into something like a personal assistant that can build apps for you. And a new AI startup? It's letting you actually walk through videos, like you're inside a scene, in real time. None of this is sci-fi. It's all real. It's all live. And it's already changing everything. Stick around to the end because I'll show you how to try one of these insane AI tools for yourself. No sign up. Totally free. Let's get into it. The CEO of Anthropic just dropped a warning that's hard to ignore. One that paints a bleak picture of the job market within the next five years. Dario Amode, the man behind Claude and one of the most respected voices in AI safety, is sounding the alarm on what he calls a mass extinction event for entry-level jobs. He predicts that up to 50% of white-collar entry-level roles could vanish entirely due to the accelerating pace of AI automation. That's not speculation. It's based on direct insight into how quickly these models are gaining capabilities. According to Amode, we're staring down the barrel of 20% unemployment, and society isn't prepared. Not politicians, not the public, and not the companies deploying these systems. What makes his warning different is that it's not laced with doom for the sake of drama. It's a plea, a call to policymakers and industry leaders to get ahead of the disruption, to stop sugarcoating the risks and start building infrastructure that can absorb the shockwave. Amade's proposed solutions include more transparency about what AI models can do, economic policies that anticipate sudden labor market upheaval, and serious investment in workforce retraining. But his biggest worry? That these conversations are still happening in silos, disconnected from the reality millions may soon face. And the most concerning part is how fast this is moving. We're not talking decades, we're talking years. The fear is no longer whether AI will disrupt the job market. The fear is that we've already passed the tipping point and no one's hit the brakes. But while Anthropic is raising the alarm, Google is quietly launching something that could blur the lines between reality and illusion, leading us straight into a different kind of chaos. While Anthropic warns us of mass unemployment, Google's latest breakthrough shows us exactly why those fears aren't unfounded. VO3, Google's new video generation model, isn't just impressive, it's unsettling. In a matter of seconds, it can generate hyper-realistic videos that look like they were filmed in the real world, complete with camera motion, lighting effects, and audio synced to mouth movement. And it's already confusing people. Take one viral example, a heartwarming video of a supposed emotional support kangaroo. On mute, it feels real, gentle, lifelike, and emotionally convincing. But listen closely and you'll notice something's off. The voices are gibberish. It's completely AI-generated. Still, thousands shared it as if it were fact. That's the dangerous part. We're entering an era where you can't trust your own eyes. If a fake kangaroo can pass for real, what happens when political speeches, breaking news, or surveillance footage can be generated with the same precision? To combat this, Google introduced Synth ID a stealth watermarking system that embeds invisible markers into AI-generated videos, images, and even text. These marks can't be seen or heard, but they can be detected with Google's internal tools to verify whether something was AI-made. The problem? Synthid only works on content created with Google's tools. Videos from other models or jailbroken systems won't carry the mark. In other words, we're playing catch-up with a technology that's already ahead of us, and this isn't theoretical anymore. These tools are public. VO3 is already out there. We now live in a world where AI can generate lies that feel more real than truth, and the average viewer won't know the difference. But what if the browser you're watching this video on could help you fight back? Opera has a new AI-powered tool that just might change how we interact with the entire internet. As AI-generated media becomes harder to detect, the tools we use to interact with the internet need to evolve just as fast. And Opera is stepping into that space with something radically new. A browser that doesn't just help you browse, but one that acts on your behalf. It's called Opera Neon, and it's the company's bold entry into what they're calling the agentic web. This isn't just about AI chatbots embedded in a search bar. Neon is designed to understand everything happening on your screen in real time, every button, every form, every interaction, and take intelligent actions based on what you need. Need to book a flight? It'll handle the comparison shopping and fill out the forms for you. Want to generate a blog post or create a website from scratch? It can build, edit, and even host your content in the cloud. You can chat with it like you would a virtual assistant, or simply let it work autonomously. Opera splits the experience into three layers. Chat for natural language interaction, do for autonomous task execution, and make for creating full applications, games, or media. The browser can even install development tools, debug its own work, and improve the results over time. It's not just browsing, it's co-piloting your entire digital life. 
And unlike most cloud-based AIs, parts of Neon run locally, meaning your private data, like passwords, browsing history, or sensitive forms, never has to leave your device. That balance of power and privacy could make Neon one of the most important tools of the agentic future. But speaking of interactive experiences, what if instead of clicking around a website, you could walk through a video, beyond the frame, and explore an AI-generated world in real time? That's exactly what a mysterious new startup just made possible. While Opera Neon redefines how we interact with the internet, a new AI startup is redefining how we interact with reality itself. Meet Odyssey, a fresh AI lab co-founded by X-Cruise control pioneers and backed by Pixar's Ed Catmull. Odyssey isn't building a search engine or a chatbot. They're building something closer to the Star Trek holodeck, a place where AI-generated videos aren't just something you watch, they're something you explore. Their new platform lets you interact with video environments in real time. Using your keyboard, you can move through AI-generated worlds, step into a forest clearing, walk through a foggy parking lot, even enter a mall that never ends. These are not 3D game engines. They're not pre-rendered CGI environments. They're live, AI-generated videos that morph and react to your movement every 40 milliseconds. There's no scene loading, no stitching, just seamless, dreamlike immersion generated on demand and streamed to your screen using high-performance GPU clusters. And it gets better. Odyssey isn't stopping at dreamlike exploration. They've also launched Explorer, a 3D world generator that can turn a text prompt into a detailed, photorealistic environment using a technique called Gaussian splatting. These environments aren't just for play. They can be imported into Unreal Engine, Blender, or After Effects and used in actual film production. The implications are massive. We're looking at a future where AI doesn't just generate content. It becomes the engine of interactive worlds, simulations, and maybe even new economies. And unlike passive AI tools, Odyssey gives you agency. You don't just consume. You move, you explore, you direct. And here's the best part. Click the link in the description to try one of Odyssey's playable AI video demos right now. It's real. It's live. And it's the clearest glimpse yet into the immersive AI-powered future we're heading toward. The future of AI isn't coming. It's already here. Jobs are on the line. Reality is blurring. Your browser is turning into your personal agent. And AI-generated worlds are no longer science fiction. They're clickable. As we watch this next era unfold in real time, one thing is clear. The tools you use today will shape how you live, work, and experience the world tomorrow. Staying informed isn't optional anymore. It's survival. So if you found this video valuable, don't just move on. Subscribe to AYN so you don't miss a single breakthrough, breakdown, or blind spot in the AI revolution. And if you want to go hands-on with the tech we just covered, click the link in the description to experience Odyssey's interactive AI demo for yourself. This is ANN, AI News Network. See you in the future.